This will put a smile on your face. We are talking about an extraordinary program. It's giving children with special needs the chance to help train future service or military dogs, just like this one. <laughs> this one is Mercer. Mercer. Hi, Mercer. When the students go out in public, it's okay. And they've got their little puppies in the pouches. It immediately creates opportunity for interaction with people. Oh. So there you go, those are students with autism. And as you heard there, the puppies are a bridge to a social world that can be very difficult for them. Meanwhile, the students themselves give the puppies valuable experience as well. To explain is Elizabeth Doolin. She is from the Lion Paws program and Sarah Rosenbaum from Paws for People. They join us now and they are very popular here in the studio because they have brought puppies with them. And that always makes us smile. But you know, more importantly, you guys are doing great work here. Let's talk about first the kids with autism and their special needs and that gap that is bridged by these puppies. How is that being done? Because we've heard animals create sort of a special bond for these children. Okay. How Thank is that you. done? Um, well, the nice thing is when we think about our kids, we're really thinking about who they are as individuals. So what makes them special and extraordinary mm -hmm. and unique? And a lot of our kids love animals. Yeah. So we have, we had an opportunity to introduce animals into our program, and um, we have you now used the puppies to do that, Bridget. <laughs> what, what, what sort of effect do you see on these kids after a while? Um, there have been numerous effects. Uh, first of all, we love that the kids can take responsibility for the puppies. That's one big one. The other is for them, when they go out socially, there's a lot of anxiety, or could be a lot mm -hmm. of anxiety, and having the puppy sort of um, creates an opportunity for the kids to connect on something mm -hmm. that's about something other than themselves. So they don't, they can concentrate on the puppy and the puppy questions and the cuteness of the puppy mm -hmm. and it um, kind of reduces anxiety is one of the things we're seeing. That's for sure the cuteness, but Sarah, this is also benefiting the puppies as well. Tell us about that. These are sort of service dogs in training. You want to get down there, <laughs> okay. It is. When they grow up, they will be out in the world with somebody. And so the children taking them out is not only benefiting them, but the puppies are being introduced to real world situations. They're in Target and hearing the carts and um, meeting new people. And so when they are working, they're not distracted by um, those potentially new curious things. And they will become service animals, which is such an important job you sort of see. T tell me about this golden. This one in particular is very special because it sparked this program, right? I did, thanks. This is Langley. Langley. And she um, was given to the Lionheart School from Paws for People. And the kids, she has just been amazing with the children. Um, some kids, and I can give you a little story. When we were taking the puppies to Target, one of the little girls had always gone to Target with her mother. It was something they did. Um, they had done a routine. And this little girl did not want to go to Target without her mother and following her same routine. But with Langley, she went into Target, followed a different routine than she's ever followed before. So again, it gave her something um, that she could get excited about and feel comfortable with. Yeah, it sort of breaks down that barrier. And you can see why, because they're so adorable. And I know you guys can't see at home, but we have an entire sort of viewing audience of our staff here because they're so enthralled with them. And that's sort of what maybe engages some of these children with special needs. And we want to be able to give you more information so you can learn more about the program. So we'll link that to our website. But to the both of you, thanks for being with us. And especially thanks for bringing your friends because they always are welcome here at Weekend Express. Take thanks, care. Great. Thank, Thank you. you.